Hello everybody, it's the Minecraft Guy 105 here, and today I have this pretty cool uh, redstone thing here. So, what it does is it makes a wave of almost any block you want. Um, so let me make sure it's set to lapis, which is right there, just because I like lapis. And if I push this button, you'll see this whole wave of uh, blocks was done. Now this is actually a really popular video. A while ago, actually pretty long time ago, um, of like, it was a piston mod, like, that uh, shot blocks up in the air, I think, but uh, I did it in vanilla Minecraft with command blocks, and I know other people have probably done that too, with like, slime blocks and things like that, but I did it with uh, command blocks. So I can go ahead and remove the wave, and I could replace it with fire. So now we have a fire wave, which is pretty cool. Uh, it doesn't, oops, it doesn't work with uh, water or lava. It just disappears if you do it with those blocks. I don't know if that's a glitch or not, but uh, yeah. So yeah, I have diamond torches are actually really cool. I just picked out some of the blocks I thought were kind of cool. And we have, uh, you already saw lapis, glass, the texture kind of glitches, it gets dark on the sides and things, but it's still kind of cool, you can still see through it. And we have pumpkins, <laughs> I don't know why that's funny, but there's just all these pumpkin faces just flying up and down. Then we have slime blocks. I thought this would be funny since slime blocks make things bounce. They're actually not see-through, which is pretty weird. You'd think that they would, especially since the glass did it, but... Um... So, all this is is one command in every single one of these command blocks. And, uh, I'll try to put it in the description, but... What it is, is it summons falling sand one block above it. And it sets the time to one, so time colon one, drop item colon zero, uh, tile ID, this is the block you want, so lapis is like, I don't really know what lapis is actually, but you put the block ID there, and then motion, uh, 0, 0.0 comma 1.0 comma 0, 0.0, the 1.0 is up in the air, so I can actually take this command block and put it over here and do that and now this slime block will just bounce up and down um oops there we go and so how i got the wave was actually with repeaters so if i go ahead and take this block and you just make a pattern like this right there and uh, just choose any corner you want for the button. I'll do it over here. And um, from this command block, uh, on one of the button sides, so if you're looking at the buttons, on the right button, you want to have go the repeaters go right. And on the left, you want to have them go left. So it's kind of like a diamond or a V, I guess. And then after it reaches these corners, you want to have it go back this way into this command block over here. Uh, top down fall. All right. So now you have a diamond, and then the repeater, the repeater facing this way. You want to have uh, f from all of these blocks. You want to put repeaters facing in this way, and for the repeaters going that way. Um, you want to put them going this way. It's kind of confusing, but if you just watch the video, maybe pause it a couple times, you get it. And um, now you'll see that it'll summon uh, these slime blocks, and they'll all land, and then you have to break them all and hear that uh, annoying noise. Anyway, um, so... Now you could just put uh, blocks on top of these if you want it to keep repeating the wave pattern. Oops. And then just put 
pressure plates on top of there. And they have to be wood pressure plates or pressure. Yeah, pressure. How do you even say it? Weighted pressure plate. There you go. Um, because I don't think stone pressure plates will pick up the sand. So if I do that, when it hits the... Yeah, it goes away. So you need to have wood pressure plates or one of the weighted pressure plates. So, um... And if you want to remove the wave, just do slash kill at E. A square bracket and do type equals falling sand. With a capital F and S on falling sand and no spaces. And click enter and then you'll see it'll all go away. Um, so that's pretty much it for this video and thanks for watching.